Hey guys, RPM here. Hope you're doing well and having a really great day in this video. I am wanting to show you all the sound difference from my Bitcoin Bitmain S19J Pro. This is a 104 terahash model in a food cooler contraptions of sorts that I got from a gentleman. He graciously sent this to me and it was amazing. This thing is just awesome. I made a video about, I think a month ago, about how to mine Bitcoin at home quietly. You guys can see that video down below of the gentleman who made this for me and just did an amazing how-to step-by-step, very thorough, like seriously, this is a work of art. It's utterly amazing. In this video, I want to prove to you all a bit further the sound difference that this thing does in comparison of to when this thing is was outside my desk, right outside on my table, just mining in my garage and disrupting the neighbors. And I got a noise complaint and yeah. So that's why I have one of these guys that really drastically lower the sound volume, like the decibel rating coming out of the S19J. So that's what I want to do in this video and that is why I just turned off all of my mining rigs and I just hit my camera on my shelf there. So all of my test rigs and all of my mining cave tower is now all off and also in this video I do want to see the exact power consumption coming out of this Bitmain Antminer S19J Pro. Hey guys it's RPM in the future. I forgot to record this in the video so here it is now. We're using about 13.9 amps at 240 volt, 242 volt. And here is the power consumption, 3,340 watts, around there. Oh, looks like the fans just went down a bit. So now it's at 3,260, 70 watts. All right, continuing on with the video. In another video, I'm going to add a, a new firmware update where it should get about 130 terahash at less than 3,000 watts. So that's gonna be cool. I'm gonna do that in another video, so stay tuned. So you guys had a lot of questions in that video and also were concerned that you know the noise and also the heat wouldn't be sufficient enough within this cooler. And so one thing that I did, uh, you guys may have noticed right now, is that normally uh, the gentleman who made this for me, really, seriously, thank you again, man. It was great, it was awesome, but there was a power supply, I'd say the power supply was giving off a decent amount of heat. So what I did here was, uh, normally it was open all the way up to here and the power supply air was going through out in the box. So what I did here is just added another like barrier, like a layer of uh, HVAC tape here along with, I layered multiple pieces of cardboard and you know, the certain sizes that I needed just to make sure I cover and get the power supply heat air through this exhaust hole here, okay? So it's all gonna come out through here. Everything coming out of that S19J is gonna be coming through this part here. So guys, I'm going to, I just wanna record the sound here. It's about, 32, 33 decibels. Nice and quiet, right? Super quiet in my garage. So what we're gonna do now is we're gonna close it up and we're gonna place the contraption here at the very top of my Amazon, oh no, this is my Costco shelf. Okay, I'm gonna place this guy at the top here with the intake and exhaust and this is the intake piece here just to let you guys know and that is the exhaust piece right there and sadly it has to face this way because I didn't communicate to the gentleman that I was gonna shoot it out this way in this direction how he has his is shooting out in that direction which I'll show you guys a clip right here you may still hear some noise in the background but to put that in comparison That is the difference between not being able to have an A6 mine in your house and potentially being able to have an A6 mine in your house. All right, you guys will see this on top in three, two, one. And this video is sponsored by Wadham.io. Wadham is a complete Bitcoin mining solutions provider and the largest distributor of Bitcoin mining equipment in the United States. Wadham has got all your mining needs covered by offering everything from the latest ASIC miners to mobile mining containers and power transformers, as well as complete hosting services and full facility buildouts. 
Their team of over 100 mining experts has got you covered by offering exceptional customer service. They also offer installment payment plans, which makes getting into Bitcoin mining or scaling your existing mining operations that much easier. Link down below to wadim.io slash RPM. All right. <laughs> this looks... This looks pretty ridiculous, I have to say. You guys are probably laughing your heads off right now. All right, so it's quite elevated on my Costco shelf here. Like the reasoning behind why it's up here is because you all know I'm in my garage and I don't have any external like windows or anything. You guys know I live on an HOA here. Oh, actually not for long. Actually another maybe couple months here, I will not be in this garage. So stay tuned for that video where I have to move out everything. But in the meantime, guys, let's go ahead and turn it on. And let me just grab my phone for the, actually, no, we don't need my phone. We're gonna turn this on. So I got two C13 to C14 cables. These are from infinitecables.ca. And uh, you know what? Let me just put my camera down. And we're gonna put this. Let's turn it on and see what the sound difference is. And then the next thing is the network. And actually I plugged in the network cable already. Okay, so I just heard it. I just heard it come on. Can you guys hear that? I don't think you guys can hear that. Here's the intake. 58, 57 decibels. I mean, it, to me, it sounds very quiet right now. I don't know if you guys can tell. It's hard to tell as with the mic I have on right now on my camera. Okay. It's now coming on. So in the beginning, the S19J Pro does turn on at like 100% fan for the first like minute or two, and then it'll, it'll come down. Okay, so that's, that's, that's it ramping up right now. <laughs> 81 decibels over here. All right, that's at 100% fan. So, this is about the same noise as my 30, my single RTX 3060 rig. If you guys saw in the beginning, uh, according to my decibel reading here, it's about 65 before in the beginning, I believe. Now it's 62. So, normally, when my S19J was on my table here, it was about, I don't know, 80 to 85, I don't know, like 90 decibels or something. So it's definitely a lot quieter right now. All right, so it just died down. 59, 60 decibels now. All right. All right, so let's just keep going over here. Fifty five, fifty six now. Fifty four, fifty three. All right, so now it's probably starting to mine because it just turned on. I'm gonna give it like another, I don't know, couple minutes here and we'll go on the laptop. Okay, we've been running for about 10 minutes, 10 minutes and four seconds. Actually, if I refresh, 10 minutes and 16 seconds. And uh, just to let you guys know, this is the S19J Pro and everything looks good. Mining temperature, network status. Okay, so the temperature of this thing right now, it says inlet temp is 57, 55, 55 Fahrenheit. Now the outlet temperature is 71, 71, 71 or 80, 77, 74. There must be multiple sensors here, so that's pretty cool. You can see the fan speed, that's how they are at right now. And uh, I have been hearing the fans go on and off, I guess, as it gets cooler or hotter. The fans are on auto right now. But the biggest difference right now is the sound. 
It's about 63 decibels over here. So it's a little bit, I would say a little bit louder than my mining, my mining cave tower. Okay, when I had all my mining cave rigs on, like this is the sound, like in terms of the loudness and decibel rating that I can hear. Okay, so it's about 61 as where I'm standing. When I had my S19J Pro on my desk, right, it was like 85. A good 20, 30 decibels off on this thing is amazing. Like this is, this is really good. This is really good. I will no longer hear this upstairs or in my, uh, in my studio area there. I will, will no longer hear this. So that, that's, that's great. I, you know, my camera microphone may pick up the small set, like, my camera microphone right now is picking up probably everything that you guys can hear from this thing. But honestly, this is a big difference, okay? This is what I wanted to show you guys. All right, some of you guys didn't want to believe, didn't believe me, and you know what? I could open up the top and you'll even hear a, a bigger sound difference. Okay, so I don't know if I don't know if you guys can pick it up or not on my on my camera mic here, but the high pitch whine noise, it's basically gone. That's basically gone. Right? When I open that lid, you can audibly hear the high pitch whine noise much more as when the uh, when the lid was open, obviously. So it is a really big difference in my opinion. Let me know what you guys think. Alright guys, that's it. That's all I wanted to do in this video. Also update you all that it is functioning now. I, I won't have this forever. In the next month or two, maybe three months max, I will no longer be in my garage here. So I'm gonna have to move all of my mining cave tower and uh, the S19J Pro and the contraption and everything. So that's it guys, that's it for this video. Let me know your thoughts. I appreciate you all. Have a good one and peace out.